catch on third down there right at the end. You talking about the last, the last play? Yeah. I mean, it was just cover zero. You know, Matt, you know what I'm saying, being a better quarterback than he is. You know what I'm saying, around. Rec um, recognizing the coverage, you know, just dumping it down to me on the shuttle cross. Yeah. Tyreek, did uh, Damian know you were running with him on that play? No, he had no clue. I told him if we had like five more yards, I would have stripped the ball for him and then took his touchdown. I told him that. <laughs> It looked like you started out just trying to get in front of the, the last guy chasing him. Yeah, and then I noticed that I could actually run d wood down. He was like right there. I was like, okay, I, I don't mind showing my speed. You know what I'm saying? So On that yeah. first touchdown, uh, you just take us through the pattern. It looked like you, you made a, a, a quick cut uh, toward a sort of flag. I mean, it was just... It was just a sale route, you know what I'm saying? I, I did a good job selling it. Um, we practiced that the whole week. I mean, Coach Reed, he was even, Coach Reed and my receiver coach, he was even telling me to sell, sell it because they were like a lot of cover two. And that particular play, I believe, was cover one, I, I believe, but I sold it. And then Matt threw it, a perfect dime, offensive line, protected, did their thing, and I was able to um, catch it. From upstairs, it looked like that ball was going to be overthrown. Did you ever think? Oh, Can nobody overthrow me? No, I don't do that. I don't do that. All right. Tyreek, you had, I think the first two balls to you today were, were you got hit hard, I think, as they came to you, but right. maybe balls you would normally catch. Was right. that in your head at all? I mean, no, I don't ever think about that. I mean, even if I, like, do something bad, I mean, I always go to the next play because my teammates, I mean, they're going to hold me accountable, but, um, but at the same time, it's a long football game. you got 60 minutes to play, play football, so, I mean, I just move on to the next play. Uh, on the third and four, right. late, late in the game, you right. had, I guess it was a hot route? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Just talk about what you recognize there and what, what Matt saw. I'm, I'm trying to see what, um, which route you're talking about. It was uh, the, the right before the right the field goal. Last one. Oh, yeah, the shallow cross. It's yeah. cover zero. Matt just dumped it down to me. And then, because the dude was playing like eight yards off, he dumped it down to me. I, I, was, I was able to make a miss, get a few more yards, and Sammy made a great block for me to get a few more extra. Trailing late, you got a couple of chances back there to return punts. Right. When did you know you were going back there? I mean, it's really on. It's really on. Coach told whenever he need me, I told him I'm available whenever. Just let me know whenever you need me. <clears throat> what did he say to you when he sent you out there? Hey, he said, "Hey, let's go, Reed. Let's go. Is it gonna be a bad kick or a touchdown?" Which, so, it was a bad kick. How much? How much did you feel like you guys needed this type of victory coming from behind, close battle, everyone sort of making an effort there in the fourth quarter to get the victory? Oh yeah, this was a great win. I mean, great team win. Offense, defense, special teams. I mean, we all did our thing, and this team needed this victory. You know what I'm saying? Because the all, because the um, the vibe, because the vibe in the um, locker room the past few weeks um, been down. So a win like this is great, especially um, I guess a great team like this who's got a great quarterback, great head coach. I mean, great team. Period. So this was a great win for us.